Hey guys, Rob here with the AJ team at Keller Williams Realty and today I'm going to talk to you about the difference between a home inspection and an appraisal. Alright, so with a home inspection, the whole focus and goal of a home inspection is to determine the current property condition. So you're talking about foundation, you're talking about the roof, you're talking about heating cooling system, electrical, plumbing, appliances, things of that nature. You want to know what you're actually purchasing so you pay someone independently to go in there for you to determine what it looks like for you. And then from there, you can use that as a bargaining chip or a negotiation tip to uh, negotiate with the seller to determine you know, what items you want repaired, if it's in distress, or what the current situation is, okay? Um, how much does a home inspection cost? Well, it can vary. Typically, they can range anywhere from $300 on a low end if you're buying a smaller condo to all the way up to five, $600 depending on the size of the home and sometimes the purchase price. So make sure you call and talk to a couple of different inspectors to get some different quotes. Now, when is it ordered? Typically, it's ordered within the first seven to 10 days of you getting ratified on your contract. That's pretty standard throughout the region here. So within those first seven to 10 days, you're gonna order your inspection, you're gonna be there for your inspection, and uh, typically right after that, once it's completed, your inspector is going to get a report out to you within usually one to two business days after that. And then from there is when you can get with your agent and talk about the next steps to negotiating any of the items that you might want repaired. All right, so let's flip over and talk a little bit about what a home appraisal is about. So a lender requires you, if you're financing the property, to get an appraisal because the bank wants to know what the current market value of the property is. The bank doesn't necessarily need a home inspection. Matter of fact, they don't need a home inspection. All they need is an appraisal to determine value. Now within that value, they are gonna take into account the current condition of the property as well. All right, so how much does an appraisal cost? An appraisal is a little bit more of a concrete figure. You're looking at somewhere between 400 to maybe around 500, maybe 550 in certain places. So a lot of that's gonna depend on size. It's gonna depend on which appraisal company the, the lender uses. And it's also gonna depend on if you're buying it as an owner-occupied property, like a primary residence, versus an investment property. All right, so when is an appraisal ordered? Typically, an appraisal is gonna be ordered after the home inspection phase is completed because really you don't want to spend money and commit to spending money on an appraisal if you're not happy with you know the, the condition of the home so the lender typically will wait for the home inspection to be completed once that's taken care of and that contingency is removed then they'll move forward with ordering the appraisal um, how long does it take for the uh, for the appraisal to come back it's usually somewhere between five to seven days after the appraiser has actually gone out to the property and actually done his, his physical walkthrough of the property and seen what he needs to see. Usually it's five to seven days after that. In certain cases, depending on the market, it could be quicker. If it's a really, really hyper busy market like we're about to get into, it may take a little bit longer. So you're gonna to wanna to talk about those time frames also with your agent. Um, if you have any questions specific to home inspection versus appraisal, we look forward to seeing you when we, uh, when we go over our buyer consultation. But uh, you guys have the dream, we have the address. We'll see you guys next time.